Joining me is LSU linebacker Kendall Beckwith. And uh, Kendall, first off, it's, whenever it's senior day, obviously the guys that are underclassmen want to go out and send those seniors off with the right. victory. What was it like tonight? Oh, that, I, mean, you, I mean, you said it best. You know, we just wanted to send these guys off with a win. And uh, I'm just glad we get this team win for those guys. I mean, it's just been an honor playing with them. And, you know, I'm going to miss I'm going to miss I'm going to miss those guys. It's been a tough month. What's it like to get a victory? How's that, how's that feel? Oh, man, it was just it was, it was one of the best feelings I probably experienced in life. Uh, man, it's been a rough three weeks, you know, three, past three weeks. And just to get a win, man, it's just it meant everything to us and this, this football team, you know. I know you guys try to seclude yourself from everything that's going on, but what was it like to watch your coach get that reception? Not only the pregame, you got a stand and oh, but after the game, you guys carried him off the field. I mean, that just reminds me of, you know, with the fans chanting. And it just reminds me how great the fans that we have. I mean, it's just a blessing to be a part of this organization and it's just a blessing to be a part of this program. And man, I wouldn't have it. I couldn't see no, no other guy being my head coach. And I know a lot of guys felt that way. I mean, that's probably the reason why they, they picked him up and carried him off the field, you know, because. I mean, Coach, Coach Miles means the world to us. The uh, LSU athletic director came out in support of Les Miles, so we're going to move forward as he was our coach. W what is it that about him that you guys love so much? What makes him such a good coach? Well, I mean, he just has a great personality. Uh, he's all about the team, and, and he's all about family, you know. We just kind of just built the bond together. All just built the bond together. And I know that we'll, we'll do anything for each other. We all we just got each other's backs. For the defense, it's been an up and down year, and uh, this was a nice way to go out, really right. shutting down a, an offense that's uh, put a lot of points on people. Right. Uh, well, I, I feel like it's one of our most, most most complete games as a defense. You know, uh, we held them to se seven points, and you know that's that's, that's really big. You know, because they're high, like you say, they're high powered off offense, and man, it was just it was just good to go out like that and you know get that team win. When you think back on this season, and you know eight and three, obviously if you to beat McNeese, you should have been nine and three. Right. It moved before you moved to a bowl game. What, what, is, what is it that you'll take from this year? Uh, I mean, you know, you, it's going to be adversity. You know, you just got to move forward, and you know, just try to build from it, and you know, try to move on from it. You know, and man, I, you know, it just it's been a, it's been a tough ride, but you know, it's just I mean, I wouldn't have no other way. You know, I feel like everything happens for a reason, and. I wouldn't have no other way. Enjoy the break and good luck in the bowl game. Appreciate it. All right. Kendall Beckwith, let's go back to Victor in the studio.